All right, all right, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, we are back here in Wales. Let's see what else we can uh, get up to, what trouble we got. <laughs> Hopefully Gunner doesn't lose his leg. Am I able to switch back to my cloak or do I keep this Halloween one? Keep the Halloween one, okay. <laughs> Hold on, I want to see some. Hello, little one. The croaking toad hopped down the road, followed by an owl. Just beyond their fetid lake, the ghosts are on the prowl. That was a little weird, but I like it. I love how they're substituting actual little cakes for moldy cheese. That's awesome. All right, let, 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 let's, let's do this one, and then we'll actually figure out what to do. Knock knock. It's candy o'clock. I've come to trade Bob's for cake and ale. It's past the little ones' bedtimes, and I want to retire. Take your cake and go. Okay, sorry. Damn. All right. <laughs> oh wait, I want to see. Oh, that's awesome. All right. Gentlemen? <laughs> With bitter ale and sweet friends, that is a fine way to end a day. I thought the church condemned this celebration. I hate the church. Name's Gwadim, and I turned to God just three years back. Uh, what were you before? You look like a man with a past. What were you before you took up the cloth? Me? A, a, a grain farmer. Had to take up the sword a few times to protect my crops. What brought you to God? You know you need to change after the third night you wake up britchless in pig shat with no idea how you got there. <laughs> Do you like Gloucester? Ah. Tis a beauteous place. Shame they're losing their elderman. Yeah. Enjoy the festival, Quillam. Ah, perhaps a drink later. Alone with your thoughts at last. Eivor! <laughs> perhaps. Every moment is sweeter when you are the Harvest King. All this bounty. Soon, I will join it. But eat, drink, enjoy all that Gloucester's lush woods offer. Thank you. All right, last but not least. Eivor, there you are. Tefter. You're well met. Gwilim here has challenged my honor in a contest of drinks. Join us. The lab will be easy pickings. Give me a cup. Some ale, then. One for me as well. Gwillem, the warrior monk. Now we can match wills with a flagon in hand. <laughs> ale is known to blunt even the sharpest of blades, Eivor. To holy hearts and humid eyes. It is the best drunkenness returns a man to royal reason. Skull. All right, let's see what we can get up to. <coughs> oh, there's a little bit of lag. <laughs> I will not leave these lands to one who laps at ale like a cat. 
You've got some on your boots. Oh wow, there's a lot of these. That's foul. Come on. <laughs> Staggering already. And I don't know if this is like, uh, what is it? I'm forgetting what the program is called, but the program I use, or uh, the game itself with a little bit of a frame rate drop. You're going to start. Drink. Oh shit. Drink. <laughs> Show the ha, or, of course, it's just drunkenness. <coughs> oh, no. Oh, no. You're sweating. Just getting absolutely <laughs> trashed. <laughs> There we go! Good effort, Tefter! <laughs> this merriment feeds my soul. Here, another drink on me for allies new and old. Of all the elder men I've met, you are the most unburdened. What is your secret? None. It is well known. The burdens I carry will soon leave this world with me. So drink to my life and death. Death? I am to be sacrificed in the Wicker Man as King of the Harvest. Like Elderman Simkin before me and all before him. Horrible barbaric practice. A burnt offering after poor crops. They hope well-fed gods will smile upon them. A true father sacrifices himself for his people, gives his all, his blood and flesh. A great honor, but a sad fate. Hmm. When you speak these words, it reminds me of the Christ. Hi, lad. Now you can see how a man like myself sees the value in both. A toast, then, to Elderman Kunan, joyous and generous. Let each man show him loyalty until he suffers death. My friends, you are kind to me. I'd like to toast my successor, Tevder. May he wear the horns head high. this water i feel like thor chugging oceans no effect to my head or step <laughs> you heard the woman give her something stronger <laughs> this will work faster than any tonic good give me visions of all creatures that roam these hills and the sore head tomorrow to pay for it <laughs> wow that tastes awful it feels good though Eivor, speak true. My feelings be damned. I have been an ass. Do not deny it. And I, for that, I am sorry. A colossal horse's ours. Yes. Oh my Soft God. words from a heartless heathen. Only fiercer than fire among ill friends. I can be very as nice as a spring gale. <laughs> How nice is that? Tevter, with Gunnar and Bridget's marriage, our clans will unite. But we could join by oath as well. Oh, yes. My first ally as Elderman. I accept. We shall make an oath. How do we start? Yeah! The greatest, greatest oath, and the greatest union. To the oath! The treaty! The greatest! They're sloshed! <laughs> They're just gone. Oh my god. People are sleeping. More ale to seal our friendship? 
This way, this way. Look out for the black sow. Sow? Like pig? Flaming pig. Chases Flaming? you home at night. <clears throat> silly words to scare silly children. <laughs> you see magic as the stuff of children's dreams. Perhaps I judge too much. Proves I half believe. Foolishness sometimes takes my tongue. I have to piss. <laughs> <laughs> A great blackness chases stars across the sky in great whirls of color and light. Whoosh. Here we are. Right inside here. Oh my god. Tefter! 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 Where are you? Hell's breath. What happened last night? Ugh. The effects of that draft still cling. Tefter! Are you here? Did we accidentally kill somebody last night? Tefter's bodyguard. Killed by knife. No, he's a... Huh. And we're just sloshed. Okay. What's this? Apples? This pot has been broken. And it's covered in blood. A weapon, maybe. Tefter, maybe he attacked his attacker with it? Blood. Could be Tefter's. If he was the heavy thing being dragged. Let's take this. Uh oh, I have a bad feeling about this. Muddy footprints. Someone was hiding back here. What's happened here? Open this door! Come out of there! Can I... Quillam's pouch. I wonder if it still has his little something stronger. But why is it here? Better hold on to it. So, what does this lead to? The murderers hid here. Lying in wait while we approached outside. They jumped from the shadows to kill the bodyguards. And to disable Tinder. And they dragged him away. That accounts for everything. Except Gwillem's pouch of herbs. I'm still unbalanced by Gwillem's special something. Maybe Mother Mordron will know the contents. Alright, let's see. There she is! What is the meaning of this? Blood soaking our soil, and your weapon coated in the same! Conan, please. More has happened here than you can see. Give me a right to parley my innocence. I should have heeded Tevder's misgivings about heathen party guests, and now he has paid with his life. With Tevder gone, Glowachester will be without an elderman. 
Eye for an eye, your Raven clan will lose their chieftain. Get the murderer! Ah, son of a bitch. Let's try to uh, let's try to switch our uh, our cloak back if we can. Okay, it doesn't matter. We're we're just in this. What do you see? Where are we going? Over there. Well, just lovely enough, we were poisoned. Terrible business. Where's Gunnar? He might be able to help us. Go, Sunan. We're looking for the healer. She's somewhere around here. There's more. Hello again. Eivor, you remember. Indeed. It's a surprise to see you. Is everything quite all right? Not even close. No, it's not. I awoke in Tefter's wrecked home. Blood, but no body. Kunin's men are after me for the lad's murder. Uh-oh. Did you stab him? Mother, can I see? Blood, but no body? We must see what has happened to him. Do you recognize the contents of this pouch? A very unusual blend. There is a druid who uses this mix to aid sleep. A monk called Gwilym poured some of it into my drink last night. The effects were intense. Search the houses! Can't have gotten far! They're coming for you. If they know I've aided you, it'll be my head next. Can you? I've seen nothing and no one. Mother, if the stranger wants more of the herbs, they can talk to the druid Halliwyn. Yes. Halewin's cabin is on a lake, near where the Cherwell and Great Ouse rivers meet. But he is a strange fish. Rarely does he speak to mortals, preferring the company of spirits. Now, I have business at Rollandrich. Find me there later. Okay. So, on the, uh... It's a lake near the crossing of Carolwell... Carowell and the River Ooze. So where is... What river is this? And what river is this? That's the Thames? This is the Ooze. So like right here? Yep. Actually, is there a fast jump point near there? Yes, this one. And it's a straight shot. Oh my god, I keep this skull. Can I keep the. <laughs> Can I keep this? I also find it funny how nobody actually like questions of of the uh, skull mask. No one cares. <laughs> well, we know the monk probably killed him or took him. The only question is really why. <laughs> right, we're 
right about there, almost. I need your eyes, my friend. Yeah. That must be the home of the druid. The fellow's land is peopled by men of straw. Knock, knock. speak to Eivor, but perhaps you'll speak to the spirit of the Meryl. Do it. Let's try again. Oh, spirit! You have finally come! Days ago, a passing cloud foretold your arrival with droplets of sun-scented rain. But what form of being are you beneath this guise of horse and bone? From the realm of the Fey? I know you cannot say. I, I press no more. Whatever you be, now you are here, the ritual may begin. Oh, but the men of straw must announce you with sparks. Ignite the sky to begin anew, here at the death of the season. Until then, I await you, giving thanks in the glen. Okay, so what do we need to do? Just burn the wicker men? Halewin said that the wicker men must announce me with fire. Perhaps I should set them ablaze. In chorus. Where, uh, there's one right here. Another! Let there be cacophony! One more! One more! This symbol is one I've seen, carved into shields and headstones. Okay, look, not gather strat. Okay. Where's the last one? Ah! They roar! Do you hear them? A chorus of fire! That should be the last one. Back to the druid. Speak to me, O oh wind. I have come to ask you a single question. Something about your demeanor and your physical manifestation now gives me pause. Are you truly a spirit of light? I'm a spirit as any other. Then prove it. You must know the depths of the world's mysteries before I will help you. Tell me the proper use of charms. Very well. Ask your riddles. Which charm is it that gives speech to the dead? Give me a measure of time. Are you a spirit of darkness? If it be not so, come back and try anew. What are these things he's asking me? There must be trinkets around his house that will help. Okay, let's, uh, let's search his house. A hangman's noose. A knife. And the vile smells of poison. Three ways to kill someone. Lords of the Lowly die a, uh, threefold death. A hangman's noose, uh, stifles the breath. A knife turns quick to mud. Drink from the well, you'll cough up blood. Something down here. Two ladles carved from a single branch. The grooves match. The rise of the moon, the uh, set of the sun. One is two and two is one. Day breaks. And mend cloth to eat, uh, cloth evening falls, they snare the broth. Okay. 
This dagger is placed upside down. I don't see a dagger. Oh. Oh, wow. I'm blind. Is there one more thing? Ah, right there. It looks like it's outside. Hold on. Oh, come on. <gasps> Goals. Their mouths are open, like they've been screaming secrets. Okay. Speak to me, O oh wind. Have you found yourself? If you are a spirit of light, answer me this. Which charm is it that gives speech to the dead? The Skull's Soul's Charm summons voices from Death's realm. In such fashion, I speak to Druids long dead. But of course, you, a spirit, would know that. Which charm summons aid for maidens? Oh, did I not Are find them Are you a all? spirit of... I thought I found them all. This symbol is one I've seen, carved into shields and headstones. Alright, so something else might be- must be in his house. Because it says clues can be found in and near his cottage, so... Oh, there's one out there that I didn't get. <laughs> this is probably the only other one. from the water below. Let's see if I can get this. I cannot. Is there a hole or uh something to jump over? Nope, it appears not. Except for maybe that branch, but who's got really time for that right now? Me, oh wind. Which charm summons aid for maidens? All right, I'm assuming Sabrina. Maidens in peril are protected by Sabrina of the Severn. Sabrina the Water Nymph, yes. Tell me, oh being of air and light, which is the charm you would use to leave the past behind? The Adam A. Dagger cuts our ties with the past. The upturned blade. Things can be reversed. You know this charm. <laughs> you are a spirit of light. Mabon be praised. Would you like some bread and cream? No, just the answer to a question. This herb pouch made its way to Glowichester in the hands of a strange man. Do you know it? Aye. A mix to help him sleep. I filled this very pouch. And over a dandelion wine, he spoke fondly of his home, Kuthladrin. Kuthladrin. <clears throat> Very well. I thank you, Halloween. But this spirit has others to visit this harvest moon. Go with the wind and leaves, good friend of the hills. Okay. Let's get out of here. Kuthladrin. Strange name. 
Meanwhile, Modron awaits me at the stones nearby. How far? 300? Just to the north. But there you are. Stolen king. Asked about this land, oh, my friend. Just ahead, okay. Yeah. I can there see Motran ahead. Can I? How far has the search for me stretched? Far enough to say it's best you stick to the countryside and wear that disguise. But Tefter's body has not been found as yet. That night was full of drink and merriment. I do not remember much, but I had no quarrel with Teftir. A sorry tale. Did you learn anything from Halewin? He gave some herbs to a man from Kuth Ladrin. Name of Gwilim. He was drinking with Teftir and myself. Kuth Ladrin is the Welsh name for the thieves' warren. It's atop a hill west of here. I can lead you. I owe you a great deal for all your aid. You did not have to trust me. Teftir's fate is to my interest as well. This is a troubling development that I hope to get to the bottom of. Let us make haste then. I must find Gwilim and regain my honor. All right. This forest in Old Gloucestershire feels untamed. I feel as if I've ridden my horse through a door to another world. Aye, there is old magic here. Old magic that would be snuffed out by Tevder and his church. Tevder did speak of reformation. Do you think that's why he was targeted? There are many who would claw their way to the top. Tevder's disappearance could be the work of any. But you are a witch, open to wisdom from the gods. Have you seen anything? I see much smoke. Are there any rival Danes passing through who could have done it? If it were rival Danes, we would have heard their horns by now. We are not a humble sword. We <laughs> <Blunt> tongues and <laughs> sharp right. axes. She's very right. If it had something to do with the Vikings, they would have raided the place and been done with it. Or you would have at least seen them kill him. Kuth Ludren, the Thieves' Warren. This is where I leave you. You'll find somewhere safe. There's a shrine nearby. If you've need of me, then meet me there. Gods old and new go with you. Okay. Let's hit him, and let's hit him hard. Oh my god, shoot. <laughs> oh no. Eat me. Okay, Be that didn't eyes. actually help us. Here. Alright, you stay here. I'm gonna go slaughter some people. Should be cautious around here. Oh, my God, what the hell? Thank you, Fairy. You've 
been uh, That's Tefter's voice. So he lives. And he's alive. Uh, he's alive and well. He knows the people here. Oh no! Don't forget to rise! And we're gonna snap his neck. Yeah. Yeah. You looks need help. Yeah. No, no, no! Oh, oh wow, okay. That must be where Gwilin is hiding. Oh, shit. Oh, shit is right. Eivor, you're alive. Have mercy. I were under orders. Elderman Kurnan, he gave us coin to dispose of Tepter. Then he should demand it back. Shit sells swords, you are. Cannot kill a single man. You made a poor choice in scapegoat, Gwilim. And we thought that... If we kept the lad alive, we could squeeze Kunan for more coin to keep it secret. Why would Kunan pay to have Teftir killed? He is to be his successor. We ain't ones for details. The less we know, the better, yeah? You chose to extort the man, but you have no basis for the crime. You're imbeciles. Look, we wasn't gonna kill the lad. We've come to like having him around. Tell her. Tell her we've taken care of you. Kunan did this? Why? I've done nothing to... Oh, gods, is he dead? Wake up! Wake up! Tell the Dane I've hand-fed you like a baby sparrow! Ah. Move forward! Ah. Look, Eivor, we're mates, right? Uh, had drinks together? Remember the chickens? Speak again and I'll take your tongue! Tafter will need to see a healer. This lot have been smearing dung on his face. But I've been held for ransom by worse men. Thank you for your aid, then. And try not to get held for ransom a third time after you flee. Thank you, stranger. Give a good heart. Thank you. Says this the third time. When I awoke in this demon lair, I feared the worst. Save your strength, Tefter. It's a long ride. Kunon. He ordered my death. I don't understand. He's been like a father to me. I will ask him myself. I was mulish when he spoke of the pagans being just as we. Living in kindness under the laws of many gods. One face, many faces. It matters not. We are all blessed to be alive in his glory. This scrape has changed you, Tefter. Changed me. Changed the dressings. Hold still. There we go. Nope, nope. Mount up, please. Alright, well, at least he has a more favorable opinion of the Norse now. That seems to happen around Eivor. He's hot to the touch, and his mind fades in and out. But he lives. Perhaps a sickness of the blood. Shame, shame. He was captured by the men there? 
They claim to have been hired by Kunan. Kunan did this? I know not why, only that he gave them coin to dispose of Teftir. You can see how well they saw to that. They were alike once, the boy and Kunan. God-fearing Christians arguing the nature of life with me. But he softened. Men do great evil to cling on to power and save their skin. Perhaps he means to put Tevda to flame in his place. Does not the right demand the leader? If he made the lad's body elderman, then it would still be right to sacrifice. Then he's not safe until I've dealt with Kunan. Can you tend to his wounds? I am a very good healer. But if the gods want him to join them, I cannot stop their will. Eivor, what will you do with Kunan? I will reveal his sins. Let his people decide if he deserves an honorable death. The man tarnished your name and you would let him live? Shame for shame. Not even his guard will welcome him when I'm done. You are resolute then. Then may you ride as Rhiannon. Thank you, Modron. And please, take care of Teftir. I must get to Kunan before the festivals end. Okay, well, looks like we have our next target. We're gonna finish him off when we return. So I thank you so much, ladies and gentlemen, citizens of the Empire, for watching. Uh, and we're gonna kill Kunan when we return. I don't know if that's the last of it, but if it is, let, we'll see what else is next. Uh, so if you're on YouTube, like, comment, subscribe. On Twitch, drop me a follow if you haven't already, and I will see you all next time.